Hey, hey, Jelly Toast here, back with more Tales of Asperia. Um, I might be a little awkward because usually I look this way for my camera, but I got a new camera stand, so I have to look more this way. So, and it always looks like I'm off screen. Okay, I'm gonna have to just move my chair over. There, now I'm more on screen. Also, my chair keeps like, I keep slipping off my chair. I think when I moved, like, something got loose. So my seat is angled more down, so I tend to fall, and that's not fun. Okay, but, uh, let's see. Let us do the things. Okay. Okay, that was weird. Um, let's fight this guy, and then let's do all the things. Um, which time do I have to go to next? Oh, while I'm doing low-level stuff, I should give them low-level equipment. Uh, whoa, okay, they learned things. Okay. Now's a good time to equip people with low level stuff. In order. There we go. Ooh, combination two. Um, no, let's do it by attack power. Which one's the weakest? Yeah, let's go. What the heck is that? Uh, okay. Okay. Alright, uh, let's. Let's see, you learned everything, everything. How do I change the order? Uh, items. Um, how do I sort? How do I sort? Damn it. Okay, I guess I can't sort. Mm. Oh, but he's almost done learning that. Never mind. Uh, you can learn stuff. 626-689. Okay, so... Wait, his isn't by... Oh, whatever. Wait. Why can't they do it by, um... By attack power? This is annoying. Uh... Half damage coordinate. Yeah, sure. Oh, wait! I got new things! Uh... Yeah, let's give her happiness. Ooh. What was that? Okay, never mind. Um... Oh, his shield. Whoa! I didn't know his shield can teach him things. Oh, you don't know happiness either? Well, give you happiness. Um, oh, dang, I still don't have any new sub things for Judith, but I want to see her in different shoes. Because she's so pretty! Oh, wait. This gives me more physical attack and magic attack. Ooh. Nah, I'll keep the defense. I seem to get hit a lot anyway. He's done. Uh, 1,000. Ooh, nine, nine, four. Yep, learned that. Okay. You. Wow, a lot of people don't know happiness. And I know happiness is just a level thing, right? Yeah, occasionally increases experience thing. But might as well give them. If I'm like trying to level grind or something. Oh, he does not have iron item thrower. Oh, that is no bueno. Let's teach him that. Mmm, Iron Maiden. 10,889. Let's go to your weakest thing. Half damage quarter. Wait, oh, why am I teaching him half damage? That's a terrible thing to learn. Okay, time to change everyone's items. Wait, she's still learning stuff on her shield. Yes, yeah, she is. Oh, gosh, why are my eyes at you again? Allergies suck. Step away, EXP share, yes. Now who's learning happiness? I mean, this thing. I'm not teaching you that. 642, 678, yeah. Oh, but he doesn't really use magic. Or does he? I'll teach it to you anyway. Ugh. Happiness, yeah, we're not teaching you that. Cross counter taunt, yeah, sure. Okay. Okay. Now, let's be off. Okay. Um... World map. Where am I? Aspio... I'm in Nor. Okay, let's go Torum. Fly! I climb down. I go in. Oh, I'm still so hungry. Wait, where's my cheese balls? I need to eat my cheese balls. 
Knights versus Knights, there are some alarming things happening in the Empire. Without anyone to hold the Union together, it's in a shambles too. What? It's in a shambles too? It's in shambles too. What the heck is this? <sighs> What's wrong, lad? Do you know him, Patty? Nope, but he seems so upset. I just had to stop and ask what was the matter. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on. Is something troubling you? I bet the sound of crickets in that empty store of yours is what's got you down, huh? Rita, you don't have to be so rude. No, she's right. Oh, were you here to buy something by chance? Not really. Oh, I see. <sighs> what kind of shop is this, anyway? It's a juice stand. Juice? Why aren't you selling fish? Torm has an abundance of fresh fish. It's a waste not to take advantage of that. Yeah, the fish in Torum are famously delicious. Alright, sounds like fish juice is the answer to all your problems. That takes care of that. Fish juice, huh? Something so rare is bound to attract plenty of customers. No, no one will drink fish juice. Pretty sure the only cats would be attracted to something like that. Not to mention, fish juice would smell, you know, fishy. More side quests. Hey KB, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Be right back. Aye, fish juice is not what you use Torum fish for. But it's still too soon to show you what I have in mind. Just let me whip up a menu. You do that for me? You have my word, lad. I wish you'd quit dragging us into other people's problems. I think you offended her pride by suggesting fish juice. Now then, me hearties, I need you to all go get me these ingredients. You can't just order us around. I think we're past the point of no return by now. Oh, come on, come now. Look at how happy that shopkeeper is. Let's get to work. Your fish juice is what started this whole thing after all, Rita. Ugh. What do we need to get? Napa cabbage, tofu, kelp, scallop, salmon, squid, and shrimp. One of each of those. Once we have all of that, we'll come back here and get cooking. Thank you all so much. You wanna... Do I not have all that? I think I do. I haven't really been cooking. Welcome back, everyone. We've got all the ingredients. Yes, I had all the ingredients. Now what? We fillet the fish. Do you have a fillet knife I can borrow? I'm afraid not. You don't? I'm sorry. This is a juice stand, so... Can't we just use that one over there? Rita, darling, that knife's good for skidding apples and not much else. We'll just have to make a knife, then. Oh, if a basic kitchen knife will do, I can make one. It has to be a fillet knife. Seafood must be kept fresh. And to keep it fresh, you have to use a specialized knife to fillet it quickly. If I don't fillet them properly, these poor fish will have died for naught. I agree. Very well said. But how are we going to make that knife? A smithing guild could probably make us one, right? We're gonna ask a guild for help. It'll be faster to issue a request to the Union. That might be faster than trying to find a gill. Did you say the bar in Dongrest? What? He didn't say anything about a bar, what? Right, we could contact someone from the Union there. We should probably make sure we have all the materials before we ask to have it made. To create a kitchen knife, we'll need a sharp blade and a flare stone. I wonder where we can pick those up. Well, why don't we head for Dongrest after we get the materials? Let's set our sights on that kitchen knife and set sail! Look at this guy, stealing all my materials. No bueno. Um, sharp stone and a flare stone? Sharp knife and a flare stone? Sharp blade and a flare stone? Mm, extra item soluble synthesis materials. Um, we need... Sharp blade, got one, and flare stone. Flare stone. Flare stone? Frost stone. Insect wave, blah, 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 blah. Green star to block us. No, wait, where's flare stone? Our man's up there, great crab shell, light star gem. Oh, gosh. No. Sharp blade. 
Blue star gem, red lamps, red star gem, chica flare, blah 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 Oh my gosh, I have to go to the desert. <sighs> well, I'm going to the desert, but let's see who else I can possibly start a side quest here with. Welcome, welcome. How do you like to sell me some of your pleasures? One pleasure, five gold. What? Huh? Is it cheap? Mm -hmm. What the heck is a pleasure? All the grown-ups are going crazy about something that came out of the sea, but it doesn't have anything to do with me. Hey, Master, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Ooh, the desert! Fun, fun, fun. Not fun. I'm dreading- Oh, that's why I don't have Flare Stone, because I really didn't try to fight things in the desert. Uh -huh. Heard that the knights have been in a big hurry getting ships together. You heard right, sir. It's locked. The knights came looking for experienced seamen. Why? That's what she said. <laughs> I'm sorry. The Trino Liner Service, always providing safe and easy travel. We anticipate the sea being rather dangerous, so the Liner Service is suspended. Why do we have that weird R? What's the matter, repeat? Ruff! What the hell is that? That's your former nemesis! Stay classy. <laughs> Say again? That's the dog Yuri is talking about, who used to rule over all of the dogs and cats in the capital. He never mentioned that! Yeah, it's the little wolf. It's been a while, old man. Don't think I've forgotten how you drove me out of the capital like a common stray. You sell everything fair and square in battle. You have no right to still hold a grudge. You had to go and take pity on me. Why didn't you just kill me when you had the chance? I haven't sunk so low as to raise a paw against a defeated loser. Oh! Me? A loser? You filthy mutt. I've still never lost you in person. What? So you want to fight mano a mano? You catch on quick? No, a physical confrontation wouldn't be a fair fight. It has to be a marking battle. What? Excuse me? What do you mean? It's a battle to see which of us can mark more places that we go as our- Oh my gosh. Own territory. A battle spanning the whole globe. Hmm, sounds pretty interesting. No, it does not. It sounds gross. Nope. You sure you'll be able to keep up? That's my line. Sit around on your haunches and I'm gonna leave you in the dust. That sounds so cancerous. It's just like, that doesn't sound very hygienic. Mm-mm. Hmm. -mm. Repeat will catch up with him in no time. Yeah, I hope so. Ah, look at Tiny Raven surfing. <laughs> How long are they going to be doing it? Huh? Oh, repeat, you're finished. Woof. Where'd you go off to, Estelle? Here you go, Carol. What's this? You can use this to make notes of all the places where Repeat's marked his territory. Oh my gosh. Is this for real? Is Oh my gosh. Huh? You want me to do it? This sort of thing is what Captain Carol does best. Laugh. We're counting on you. Oh my gosh. I have to... The locations can be erased? What? When you camp, that region of the field map is marked as Repeat's territory. Mark's dog maps are viewable from the world map in the menu. Big Boss marks his territory in the same way. Be careful not to lose. How do I know when it's over, then? Oh my gosh, this is gonna be an annoying side quest. Holy crap. It even gets worse. Oh no. Ciao! Him again? Why is everything for a raven? Weather making things laggy? <gasps> no, why is it laggy? Have I been dropping frames? Does my audio sound okay? Is everything okay? 
I hope everything's okay. We meet Ancora. Anchora? I don't know. Ancora. Yeah. This is all you, old man. Everything's buffering. <gasps> no! It's not buffering for me? Hmm. Oh no, KV, I hope your internet gets better. Stop, please. No! Should I, should I keep going? But I have fast internet. Yeah, I'm on wired internet now, so mine's pretty quick. Oh. Your connection? No, KV, no! I don't want you to miss this! Uh, sorry, I got a drink. Okay, I'll just I'll just move on. Hopefully your connection gets better, KV. Why does it always have to be me? Is there anything we can do for you? That barca that's tied up in the port, is she yours? Oh, the boat? Yes, it's ours. It used to belong to Miss Kaufman, but... I was wondering... Is okay I upgraded? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> you want to upgrade it? Hold on, just a second. You do anything funny to my ship and I'll gut ya. Upgrade it, you say. What do you want to do to it, anyway? There's just something I'd like to put on it. Capiche? I won't do anything bad to it. You have my word. <gasps> hey, Web, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Repeat territory is annoying. Best way is to use a world map and go to each location one by one on camp. Oh, that's so annoying. But how do I know when it's over? Ugh. You think we're just going to let you do who knows what to our ship? Mm. Hey, Yuri. You think we might just let him do it and see what happens? Do you know something I don't, old man? Mmm, nah, not really. Just thought we might give him a chance. Guess we'll give it a shot then. How about it, Patty? Mmm, if you say it's alright, then it's alright. But I'll smell it if you do anything fishy. Sure, okay, grazie. Ben, Ben, just wait here a little bit. Guarda, I have finished. There's something attached to the ship. What did you do? I attached a salvage arm for you. With this, you can collect treasures in the sea. Holy crap. Repeat, get big bus title after completed quest. Ooh. Rule number one of the world. Nobody does anything for free. If you're good at something, never do it for free. It actually seems to be okay now. Yay, glad I got better, KV. What do you think, Patty? Hmm, it's been placed very well. The weight distribution and hull balance have been taken into account, too. Not bad, lad. Not bad at all. I also adjusted the bottom to get you through shallows that you could not traverse before. Wow. Hey, how'd you do all this? Oh, I've just been interested in the barship lately, that's all. Wow, what a strange guy. Well, see you! And even there, G! Is he gonna come back? Was that Professor Sicily just now? Huh? You know that guy? Of course! They call him the Shining Star of Core Engineering! There's no one in the world who's better at manipulating Blastia cores. Wow, that's amazing! Rita, you haven't heard of him? No, I haven't. Blastia research has many subfields. I always researched how to use Blastia to produce magical effects. <sighs> Patty's cat is still very amazing. Yeah, I love looking at that, but you get two cutsy from a peed. If you get two cutsy, then you're done. And continue marking territory until last cutsy. Oh, holy crap. I'll do the territory marking thing towards the end. I don't really want to go around everywhere in camp right now. Wow, Blastia engineers, eh? I'll bet the Architect's Guild would love to get their hands on someone like him. That's right. The Architect's Guild is working frantically to find Professor Sicily and get his help. This sounds like information Kaufman would be interested in. 
But they say that he's rather eccentric, and he only works on projects that interest him at the, at the time. That sounds about right. Haha, <laughs> let's just- let's go see just how useful that professor's eccentricity can be. Yeah, let's see what that salvage arm can do. I don't want to do it yet, though. Uh, create as with added to the fear tier. Lower the arm near specific search points to uncover hidden items or gold. You might even discover some other items. In addition, the ship has been reinforced, and now you are able to travel through shallow streams you were unable to reach before. That sounds super useful. Now I can try to get Patty costume title quest. The green clothes man added a thing for the ship. The lady might be in town now. Woo! Oh, you mean the other port, right? Or I'll just check all around here. So, some big ring has risen up beyond the sea. That's really something. It's bigger than that ring a guy once got me. Ho ho! Ah, uh, how I'd love to go see the Colosseum to rip up and throw... Huh? What? The barrier will, will protect us no matter what happens. You you think that, dude. Oh no! Oh, I accidentally pressed the warehouse! Patty's cat looks like the cat from Trigun. Oh, the cat from Trigun was so cute! Yeah. Excuse me, but would you happen to be the brave Vesperia? Huh? Yes, we are. I have a bit of a favor to ask of you. Would you mind helping me tidy up this warehouse? We're a bit short on help at the moment, and it would mean a lot if you could lend us a hand. We will pay you of your work, of course. Mm. Let's do it! I'ma do it! No problem, leave it up to us. Thank you very much, let's get started. Okay, okay, where the treasure chest is at? No, do it yourself, Arzal. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I'm like, why can't you do it yourself? Like, you weak. Okay, there's one treasure chest up there. For now, I think the only one I can move is this one. If I go up. Let's push you in. Uh, if I push you this way. I don't know where the treasure chests are in this one, so I'm just... Moving blocks for now, just to see where everything is. Whoa! Bring it back! Hmm, interessant. Okay. Um. Hmm. Hey, Bancho, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Patty had turned her title super kawaii. Oh, I can't wait, I can't wait. I need to see it. I can't go this way. Hmm. Hmm. Well, let's try pushing this in for now. Ooh, I can't. Uh, how about I bring you out? No, wait, I can't. I can't even push this dude. I can't push or pull him. You're just a useless block. Oh, I can shoot it from anywhere. Hmm. What if I... No, if I bring you to the bottom, I still can't get across. But what if I bring you... There, and fill you in. Okay, and then... Let's see... What happens if I... Oh! <gasps> this is evil! This is straight up evil. Holy crap. How are you going to have two levels? What? Okay, well. Okay, there's one treasure chest up there. Stand on the elevator block and shoot the statue from there. Yeah. Warehouse. Oh, my hand. That was a lift. Yeah, I, I said it. How are they gonna have two levels? This one I can only... Let's see. Is there one on the bottom? This one I can only push this side. Ah, okay. Let's push all these off just so that I can use them. Okay, so there's one treasure chest all the way up there. There's one in the middle. And... Let's see. No, oh, that's all the blocks I could do from this side. So I'll go back down. Extra block, woo! But where do I put you? That's the question. 
Wait, how about... Ah! I'm stuck! Oh, but this way. Damn it. There's gotta be a block up here. Mm, treasure chest! Yeah, power light. Ooh. Okay, let's try pushing... Oh wait, which one should that go in? Should that go in the top or the bottom hole? Mm. This one, there's only... One way to push it. Yeah, I can't pull it or push it, so... <sighs> top or bottom, top or bottom, top or, top or bottom, top or bottom. I gotta look again. Top is used to so bottom, then. Oh, I bring you down. Put you down. Put! Grab it! Down. And... Might as well push you in. Right? And this one might as well push you in as well. And hopefully that did helpful things. Okay. Mm, okay, now. But you're still you're still a nuisance, so let me go back around this way. Um wait a minute. What if I was there anything else? Cause what if I bring that block all the way up? Oh yeah, there was nothing else I could do here. Um, one floor? Nah, take two. Thanks so much, game. You care- you really care about me. What kind of warehouse is this? A crazy stupid one. If you push, then one of each block- If you push all blocks- Oh, they can! Oh. Why is this box here? Can I also bring you up here? I'm gonna do something weird, and I'm just gonna do this. Ooh, I can't. I can't. Shoot. Mm, I can't. Let's try pushing him there. Because I was thinking, what if I use this block? And bring it all the way up? And then that gives me... Ah, but he's still locked in a... I, I can't put him there, cause then... But then there's nowhere else... Yeah, I'll just push you off, for off to the side for now. Cause I gotta get back around. Okay. So, let's go up this way. Hey, shoot! Um, let's push all you down. What happens if I go push that one into the middle hole? It gets full. But I already pushed him up, so there's no... I guess I could push you down, and then I can use this one. Okay, you are going to be sacrificed. For the sake of this box. Come on! Oh wait, uh, what happens if I put, drop you down that- Uh, come on. I drop you down there, then you're over there. Let's try it. Come on, oh, come on! Oh, fracking. Oh my gosh, go left! There you go. Oh, wait, I gotta push you over again. Sorry. Then, then, bring him in. Drag it. Drag it. Go up. Huh. Okay. Let's see what that block did. As I thought, it blocked him there. Okay. So then, let's push you in there again. And then if I bring that guy in... Oh, 
What if I bring all these boxes up top? That's my strategy and plan for now. Bum, 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 bum. Oop, no, too much. Okay, what if I do this? And then... Ah, oh, I'm stuck! Uh, I do this. No, I still don't have enough space, so what if I... Push, push this way. Pull this way. Push this way. Oh, I think I screwed up with... I think I screwed up with this box. Oh, let me try. Oh man, which way should I put this? I think I think I gotta do it this way just so I have enough space. I still need two boxes, and I think I screwed up. Ah. Oh. Um. Can I bring you? Wait, I still have a box on top, right? Ah. Oh. Yeah, I still have a box on top, and if I drag drop you into the middle. Okay, I can drop you into the middle. I think it's safe. Wait, I can't bring you there. Okay, so I gotta bring you... Up. Oh, now I could drop you into the middle. And hopefully it'll give me an easier time. So. And? Watch, all of this is totally wrong and everyone's just like, What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Um... Okay, and then there should be... This last dude. I think I can pull him. Nope! I can't! Wait, I can push you... And then I'll be stuck. Um, wait. Let's go. Yeah, I'm still stuck. Oh, wait! I got out, but. Oh, let's try to pull. Shoot! I ran out of boxes, didn't I? There's no more on this side, there's no more on that. Ah, oh, I did screw up. Ah! Or maybe I just have to... Wait a minute, was there a box left on this side? Wait a minute, there was a box right there! Um... There's you! But I can't move you anymore, damn it. I just need one more box! Let's try getting to that last treasure chest then. Wait, did I... I, went, I came up here, right? Imagine this minigame had a timer. Let's not imagine that. I'm glad it doesn't. Ooh. I just need to reach that one in the middle. And up here didn't have a way to the left, right? Because it was blocked off at the top. No, it's not blocked at the top, but... Yeah, it is. Okay. Hmm. Let me try going back to the other side of the room. Okay, um... Shoot! I think I screwed myself over. I can't get out anywhere. Mm. Shoot, I needed a box. Yeah, I needed a box to... Do this. Okay, I think I gotta reset. But now I know where things are. But that was so long! Oh my gosh, and I have to do it all over again. This one I can only... That way. Well, I'm doing worse now, wow. Where did I push you to before? Wait. Oh wait, I know what I did. 
Nope, I don't know what I did. What the hell did I do with you? Mm. Reset. <laughs> no, I could do this. I could do this. Okay, so the box was originally here. I moved you. Right? Let's not waste a block. There. Okay. We push you into here. We pull you. And we push. Push, ag push again. Yes. Step one complete. Okay, now I have more boxes to use. Um, if I push this one down... Yes, if I push it down. I want to make sure what I'm looking at. And then that will give me access to up there. Okay, yeah, I'm pushing this one down. Pew! And then this one... I need to... Let's see. I couldn't reach that one from the bottom before, so... I'll have to probably... It from the pull it. Wait, I can't. Okay, yeah, this one I just have to push one way because there's no way I can. Is that lined up? Go! Perfect! This one. I don't know where to put those two, so let's go back down and find out. Wait, I bring this one into there. I think I could do that. Bring this one to fill this hole. Grab it! Oh! <gasps> I did the wrong one! Ah! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Wait, no wait, let me, let me go down and see my mess. Yeah, I did the wrong one! I was supposed to push it into here, and then I could walk. Oh, frack. Ah, oh, reset. Ah, oh, I was doing so well too. Uh, accomplishments. Okay, let's not waste any blocks. Go. Go, go, go. I love puzzles. Puzzles are the best. But I hate sliding block puzzles the most. They're annoying. Go. Okay. This one had to be pushed this way. Ah. This one had to be pushed one over, then down. Then it lines up with the treasure chest. Yes. This one had to be brought down. I don't... Wait, what am I doing? I have to do... No, yeah, I have to do that. Push it! Push it! There we go. And then come over this way. Yeah? And then I push it this way. I should fill the hole. Yes! Now, where to put this last one? Let's go down and see. Oh. Okay. Um... Okay, so it has to fill that hole, so... So, oh man! Wait, it doesn't matter if I bring it to the top or bottom. Oh, let's just try this. No. I want to be safe, I want to be safe. I'm gonna push it into here. Because I think there isn't a hole there. Oh! I did it! I did it right! Okay. Go down, please. Okay. And then, I could bring this box over to... I don't know where. Uh, that box seems useless. Which way do I have to... Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's do the right. Wait, this is how I get to the first treasure chest. Uh, in the middle. No, it's not. <sighs> but 
there's no way I could pull them over to the other side. Did I screw up again? Ah, oh, frack. Or, what if, what if? What if? What if? Where do you go? What if I bring you over? Then I bring you up. What if? Let's see. I'm gonna try it. Sounds blazing. Just, just try things. Experiment. No, I was wrong. Damn it. Ah, the two box on the second floor. Move it to the left screen and drop it in the top gap. Is that for um? This top section? Whoop! <laughs> it left without me! Ah. No, bottom gap? Okay. Uh, let me see how I got to the right side again. How did I get over? came over here, but I'm landlocked. Damn it, I think I screwed up again. I did! Shoot you! Ah. Okay, reset. Ugh. Top gap, not bottom. How did I get over to the right side? I don't remember. Come on, grab it. Oh, did I get to the right side by pushing this dude? I think that's how I got to the right side. Then it went kapow! Then... Then... Oh, shoot. I didn't look, really look at the land. This one I can only really push one way. No, oh, I think this one does have to go here. Well, let's get this treasure chest first because it's right here. Our light. Ah. Uh, so two box on the second floor. Move it to the left screen and drop it in the top gap. So when you say that you're saying that it's- oh shoot, let me get there. Actually, where should I move these guys? What's up there? That lets me- Really no place to move this guy except that way. Unless a box from the top falls. It can fall. Ugh! I'm starting to get a headache, but I really want to finish this. I was doing so well before, what happens? Well, this one I think I could use you at the top. Nope. I'm stuck. Uh, maybe this one does have to go down here? But what if there are boxes up there? I'll just do the same exact thing. Which boxes were down there? That one. Nope. That one, that one, that one. Whoosh! Go. Okay, yeah. That did things. Oh, that did things! Woo! And I'm back to my same predicament as before. I don't want to waste boxes, though. I think I have to. Bye! And then if I bring the other ones... Mm. This one I can only push 
left. Yeah. I'll push you. Where did you end up? Aha! And then I push you. Right, right, right. And then I go... What if I go this way? And then if I get one more, I can push it that way. I'm still gonna need a space, so... I'm still gonna... <sighs> I think I did it wrong! I think I should have pushed it here. I'm still gonna need like... <sighs> Let's try it out. Let's just experiment and do things. If I don't get it, I'm just gonna use a guide. <laughs> oh wait, I'm done with this side. I'm tired, I don't want to think too much today. <laughs> well, this, these ones are obvious, I gotta fill the gap to use the lift. Come on. Oh my gosh, where are you facing? Place face right, please. Thank you. Okay. So you want to put them into the top gap. Top gap, you say. And where did that bring it? Oh, I filled the hole. Okay. Oh. But if I don't fill in the bottom gap, there's no way I can move. Right? Mm. Let me check again. Drop it into there. Yeah. So I do have to move it to... Wait a minute. Can I push it? Nope. Okay, so this one... I'll push to there. But this one, I think I can move to the top. Uh, pull you. Pull you. Pull, okay. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Wait, I still didn't push it one to the bottom? Oh, I moved it to the top. Or I pushed it off the wrong edge. Oh. Well, then I guess you're coming this way. Oh, so, so roundabout. There, now I can get across when I use the lift. Mm hmm? And then it leaves me a box. To do things. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. Let's bring you. Oh, but I'm stuck. Do I have to use that you as a sacrifice to get that other box? Nope, nope, nope. One too far. Oh, I bit my lip and it hurts now. Wait. Oh, I was dumb. I didn't need to sacrifice that box at all. I could have just done this. Oh my gosh. I hope I didn't waste boxes. I probably did. Oh gosh. And then you can go like this. Oh, I hope you're enjoying yourself, Bancho, because I'm going crazy. Shoot, I thought there was a floor. Oh no. Oh my gosh. I thought there was a floor. Okay, so that the the one box I wasted here. I need all of them to No, that doesn't make sense. That's it. I'm using a guide. Bye. Tales of the Spiria. Forum warehouse. I can't do it. Mm. Let's use an image. 
Okay, reset. Sorry this is taking so long, everyone, but I really wanted to do this if I could. Okay. Ako, Ana, treasure. Cool. So box one goes into... Into here? Okay. I normally would try to figure this out on my own, but I'm tired today. Let's see, where does box two go? There's no two highlighted. Oh, two's from the top floor, okay. Ah, come on. Okay, so we just go... Whoop! I'm tired, I need sleep soon. Yeah, me too. Okay, so two's filled. Three is at the top, and four... Hmm... I think I have to use the lift for this. No, three, three is here. Three is here? Okay, if you say so, three is here. Three is here and four is here. Okay, three and four. Okay, five and six. Five and six. Five is all the way at the top. Where are you, five? Oh. What? Three, four. Oh, I gotta push five. So... Five? Yeah. Ah! Okay. Five... Goes... Uh, goes into here. Six is on the lift. Okay. Right? Mm, right? Can't read that. If that's the lift and that's the stone. Oh, Saradin Gude. Yeah. Wait, how does this work? Six. If that's the thing, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six is... Oh, well, let's get the treasure chest first. Six is right here. Oh, yeah, this is six. That's why I didn't see a box. Nope. Push one more and then I can push it, yeah. That's six. Seven's at the bottom floor, so... Now well, let's run back. Seven's all the way at the top. But how do I get to seven? Oh, seven was... Seven was at the lift at the top, too. Who designs warehouses th this way? It makes no sense! Seven... Just goes boop! Eight gets booped into here... Eight... Uh, oh, let's see, where's nine? Okay, I go back down for nine. But where's the box for nine? Box for nine. Where's these warehouses? Mini games aren't missable. Yeah, but I want I want to do them now while I'm here, because then I don't have to remember to come back. But where's the box for nine? Oh, the box for nine's all the way down there. Okay. This is nine. Nine has to go all the way up there. Okay, so... I... Ooh. So I was right about, like, bringing boxes all the way from the bottom to the top. Okay. Nine goes into... Nine 
Oh, oh. Push you one more over. Oh, oh no, I'm gonna be stuck. Ah! Oh wait, that's why I pushed from up here. Ha uh ha. -huh. Nine goes into yeah. Nine goes into here. Okay, and then ten. Ten is all the way on the left side. And goes down. Okay. And then eleven is on the top floor. Shoot. Okay. Eleven. Eleven. It says treasure chests. Eleven. Huh? Wait. Yeah, this is the box for eleven. What? Okay, wait. There's the stone. One, two, three. One, two, three. Four. Oh, okay, so I do push it down here. I feel like something is very wrong. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So then this does go down here? That better be 11. Okay, and then 12 goes... 1, 2, 3. 1... What? Even using a guide? This is so freaking confusing. That's the box for 12. Oh wait, or is this the bottom? the bottom floor. Uh. Okay, that's a treasure chest. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two. Three. Where do I get that box? Wait a minute. Wow, I'm exhausted. One, two, three. Okay, I think if I push it down here, or I dropped 11, and then I could pull it from somewhere. I think that's 12. And then... Wow, this is really complicated and annoying. Let me try running all the way back around. Oh, I'm blocked. I'm blocked! The heck? But it says treasure chest. One, two, three, four. Oh, shoot. I think I messed up. Okay, you know what? Stop. Bye. Mm. Oh no, return items. I'm definitely gonna try again. But I don't want to do any more here. It's been over 15 minutes, I think. I see you, oh well. Well, no pressure. Come back whenever you're ready. I will. Bye. <laughs> there are better things to do. Sorry I wasted everyone's time, but I really thought I could get that. Torum Orphanage is written on the side of the entrance. A lot of children are playing and having fun inside. This is the orphanage town! Where's the lady? Lady! Lady! The Shagathan flowers are all withered and died. You were the one who destroyed the blaster here, weren't you? Yes, that was me. I see. The reason for these flowers blooming like that was the air imbalance from the blaster you destroyed. You're not mad? I'm plenty mad. But it's in the past. I hate arguing about things that have already happened. Sometimes I feel like she might be too understanding. 
okay. But where's the... Where's the lady? It seems like the Empire is getting restless. You the lady? I really respect the salesman from Fortune's Market. It's such an uncertain time, but even so, they bark at their sales calls with such verve. It's so wonderful. Let me try talking to the flower lady again. It's sad to see a flower bloom with all its might and then wither. Wrong its, man. Are you at the last chunk of the game? I think so. I've been doing a lot of side quests and getting titles and stuff. Fortune's Market HQ. Also, that's how flowers work. Yep, that's nature. But that lady isn't very smart. Having a travel permit is Fortune Market's right, as it is our responsibility. Since you sealed off the roads, I guess you're okay with our cargo shipments not going to the capital. That's not what I'm saying. It's just like Nordopolica. What gives the knights, protectors of the people, the right to oppress them? The Imperial Knights don't need your permission to do what needs to be done. I can see we're not going to reach an agreement like this. Now, if you would please let me pass. Wait! Sadly, that what that official said is right. Yuri Lowell, and you, aren't you with Altosk? What a happy surprise to be remembered by such a lovely lady. Perhaps Altosk is planning on sticking its nose into the business of Fortune's Market? Nah, I just came to ask you for your cooperation as a member of the Union. Our cooperation? Help us make the Union as strong as it used to be. Fortune's Market is one of the pillars of the Union, or aren't you? I'm sure you know how important the Union is for the guilds. We'll all just get trampled on if we don't work together against them. This from someone who's been parading all over the world with Yuri for the past how many weeks? Altusk has already mobilized, that's why I'm out here gathering information. I hear you've been traveling as the Dawn's right-hand man and watching the Imperial Knights. Alright, let's do it. We'll save face for you and the Dawn and promote the rebuilding of the Union. I'm glad you're as decisive as they say. It is an honor to be recognized as such by someone who is so well-versed in negotiations with the Empire. Please, you flatter me. I'm just long enough to get a little clever about these things. I hope that I can do the same. Now, if you'll excuse me. She's about 70% with the game, Secret Dungeon, Patty Arc, and Last Dungeon after Alexei. Whoa! I'm that close? Dang! Nice. Raven, I'm impressed at how well you dealt with an imposing lady like Miss Kaufman. Compared to the Don, she was nothing. Yeah, the Don was more impressive. Don't just agree with me. Where's the- But Raven, you were awesome! Huh? But... Come on, let's go. Talk to me! The president is not here right now. There's nothing sadder in this world. Okay, doom and gloom. This is Kaufman's room. She might have a fit if we go inside. Let's go inside! Weapons are power, but so are distribution and finance. Fortune's market has the power to change the world. Then do it. <laughs> Gathering four elements to progress the story. Hmm? Elements? I've never heard of those before. Anything here? No, nothing here. Then why are there stairs? Useless. Talk to you. Let me talk to you. Welcome! You've come to the one store- the only store in Torum. Do I need to buy any more things? Let's- uh... Whoa, I have no- none of these. But do I need to- nah, let's not. Thank you! Come again, please! Maybe later! What are you? There's a sign on the other side of the glass. Shop open on the first floor. Come check out our goods. Oh, mate, that's her house, probably. Uh, hey, do you have any idea why they s why they sky over the capital went so weird? Another typo. I try and try, but I just can't figure it out. Uh, is there anyone worth talking to at the end? Okay, so I'm gonna try heading back to uh, Nor and seeing if the ladies on the bridge for Patty's side quest. After I talk with these guys. There are definitely Yuma's running this world. I will find one and then we'll see who have who will have the last laugh. Now I hear the Empire's the best too. I wanted to see what things were like in Nor. A friend of mine contacted me, saying it was really bad in Zephyrus. It is bad. I thought the Commandant was just an Empire's a dog. <laughs> I thought 
The commandant was just the Empire's a dog. But he really proved his worth in the rebellion. Uh, what? No, I don't think he was trying to help you. I can't believe I wasted so much time with that stupid warehouse puzzle. Oh. Sorry, I spent so much time on that. I didn't realize it was getting so long. But off to the door! Patty, Patty. I care about Patty's side quest. And if Judith has one, I care about Judith's side quest. But more importantly, I care about Judith's swimsuit. Can't wait to get her swimsuit. I'm hoping she's the only person in a bikini. Like, Estelle and Vita can be in tankinis. That I don't mind. You there, you're worried about something, no? Who? <gasps> this is it! This is the patty arc, isn't it? Who, me? Sure, but who isn't? I am the great Zarshan of the soft-boiled Cerebellum fortune-telling guild. Now then, just relax. Don't move a muscle, and I shall read your fortune. Huh? Mmm, aha! You've got a lovesick mind! Oh, wow, she's right! And in order to quell this turmoil, you must... Mmm, lash yourself to the mast of the principles you hold so dear. Principles, huh? You mean the sea teachings? What, pray tell, is that? Eifried's I teachings, they were practically a mantra. So what, your wishes will come true if you just abide by the teachings? Not just abide, by practice! There, I've told you your fortune, so pay up, that'll be 1,000 gold. Hang on, we've gotta pay? Happiness in this world doesn't come cheap, let alone free. You ambushed us, and now you want money? That's practically stealing! The kid's got a point. Uh, do I pay? Do I pay? Pay or do I pay? I don't want to mess up Patty's arc, because I actually care about her, so... Do I pay or not? Hey V, help me! <laughs> help me, please! Psh, don't pay! <laughs> but what if that screws up Patty's side quests? I don't want to screw it up because I actually want to find out more about her. Ah. <coughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> How much money do you have? I have a bajillion. Like, I have over 600,000. I should just pay, right? Uh, I'll just do it. I'll I'll pay for it. No, but I don't want to because she ambushed me. I'm gonna look it up. <laughs> Cause I don't want to mess up Patty's arc. Tales of Vesperia, Patty, Patty, side quest. Hmm. Um. Oh my gosh! I think I do have to pay. Let's do it. Well, thank you very much for your business. Oh, and one last thing before I go. The happiness you seek lies in an item dredged up from the seabed. That really narrows it down. Can't you get any more specific? That is all I have seen, my friends. Farewell, and may your love be blessed! Now, give me a title. What a shady lady. She's just like you, old man. Hey now, I'm an upstanding citizen. Dredged up from the seabed. She talking about a salvage? Sea Teachings Article 18. The open seas are full of danger, but we must not fear the unknown. Where the heck did that come from? Your love may be as vast and uncharted as the seas, but I won't be deterred. I'll pull it from the cold depths of your heart, Yuri. Knock yourself out. I didn't get anything! What? I've been cheated! Lady should be near the wanted poster sign next to the bridge. Yeah, it was the fortune teller lady, right? Yeah, I talked to her! Uh, 
I paid her. I paid her money, KB. Patty costume title quest. <gasps> I love Patty's costume. Hmm. Let's fly. I think I was done with tour, so where's the next town I have to go to? Hiliord! Fly! I'm down. Wow, Heliord looks sad. Whoa, there's people talking happily. Whoa, it's a, it's a cutscene. You too, Harith? Yes, Cotton. Huge losses. Bigger than I could have ever imagined. What's going on? It's pretty boring grown-up stuff, kiddo. Do you really want to know? Yeah, try me. We'll be the judge of that. What good sports. We've been investing in a small but successful guild that's been giving us a cut of their spoils based on what we put in. Hold it right there. This smells fishy already. It does? It does. I knew it! Wait, how could you tell? Up until now, it had really been working out, so we made a huge investment. And then the guild up and disbanded overnight! They didn't even return what we'd invested. Ah, I see. That can happen if you're not careful. Are you gonna be able to get by? We have a little bit tucked away still, but we'll have to close up shop. This is what we get for underestimating the cutthroat nature of business. So you didn't lose everything. That, there's your silver lining. Thanks for hearing us out. You're good kids. But while I've got you here, let me give you just one piece of advice. I don't care what anyone says. Money matters. You go spending it after you've only saved up a little, you'll regret it. There's three search areas in the ocean surrounded by seagulls. Oh, for Patty's costume! Oh, okay, I'm gonna have to go into the ocean then. Save up when you can. Every little bit helps. Yeah, even when you're out there fighting monsters. Even when we're fighting, eh? Hmm... What is it, Patty? Just thought of something. Aye, tis a good idea. Patty learned to search gold base art. Patty earned the Gold Hunter title. What? Find all three to complete Patty custom title quest. <laughs> okay, well I'm gonna have to really go into the ocean. Welcome to Hilliard, the newest addition to the Empire Cities. It's a crappy town. Why is it raining now? If one desires power, they must work for it. Oh. I talked to you already and you still say the same thing as last time. Like many others, I joined the knights because I always admired them. However, the reality of being a knight is much less, much less exciting than I had thought. Yes, it is. Oh, this isn't her arc. Ah, okay. I was getting worried for nothing. This is a facility for Imperial Knights. You should leave if you have no business here. There is nothing here for you. But I am Flynn. I am Imperial Knight. I'm glad to serve under you, Flynn. I don't know what would have happened to me under Captain Kumor. Yeah, would have died. Any goodies here? No? 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 Nothing. Lynn, my little angel boy, you're so precious, and I love you. Lynn, why can't you be real? Work here has gotten easier, but I've decided to put even more effort into it than before. How else am I to become noble? They say there's no shame in being poor, but it's not easy to accept, is it? Of course, having faith in the notion that you're only as happy as you believe you are can be a wonderful placebo. Hm. Spoiler alert, you find that Carol is actually an 80-year-old man <laughs> disguised as a kid. Oh shoot, Carol, that was your deep dark secret. <laughs> oh, it's Miss Estelle. Oh, Polly, how are you doing? I'm good. How's your docky? Ugh. Wow, Repeat's being nice to someone. Repeat loves playing with kids who like dogs. Really? What about me then? Look, Repeat, I like you this much. Oof. 
Natty arc will trigger automatically when you're close to final dungeon. Oh, okay. So I just have to progress with the story then, in order to see her arc. I thought it would be like a side quest or something that I missed. Hi! Hey, I thought you left this place for good. My kid likes this place. We come back from time to time. I see. That's great. Alright, Pelly. It's time to say bye-bye now. Everyone, good seeing you all again. Bye-bye! Ugh! It was nice to see him so happy. Woof. Woof. Ah! What is it? Did he fall down the bridge? Repeat! Holly was kidnapped by a monster? For real? A monster inside the barrier? Nice to know generic character number 260. For real, I don't care about that kid. Repeat ran after them. We should go too. Repeat left the party. Repeat! No, now I have to go chasing after you! Gosh, darn it. Come back. <laughs> Everyone's so careless, thinking their little barrier will protect them from everything. That was a piece of cake! Now, I wonder how much I'll be able to get for this little brat. Woof! Woof 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 woof! <laughs> you mangy hound! You dare stand up to a human? Brrrr. Damn it! Who are you? I thought it was strange that a monster would be inside the barrier. A companion of yours, I see. Give back the kid. You think I'll hand him over that easily? Brrrr. Woof woof woof! You dead now, son! These are small fry! I will destroy them in an instant! Repeat looks like a street vendor with all those dolls hanging on. It's so adorable! I love that accessory on him! Good job, Repeat! Damn it! I won't forget this! Ah! Leave him. For now, the important thing is to get Polly back to his parents. So many terrible things happen to this kid. It's just like... Damn, you're a danger magnet. Calm down, kid. Bum, bum, bum. Thank you so much! You helped us so many times. I don't know how I could possibly thank you enough. Be my slave. <laughs> think nothing of it. It's all in a day's work. I don't remember you doing all that much to help them, old man. Your doggy saved me! Woof! My comment's showing up like 10 minutes late, guess my connection acting up again. Yeah, like... Mm. I hope your connection gets better, KV! His parents ought to chain him up or something, for real, it's like, use a child harness or something. Control your child! Repeat's not the sort of pooch who'd ignore a dog-loving kid in distress. Thanks, Mr. Dog! Woof! Still wonder, why would anyone want to take Polly? Woof, woof, woof! It looks like he was just trying to make a quick buck. Ugh, I guess we have to be on our guard, even inside the barrier. What is that in his hand? What do you have there, Polly? That guy dropped something, so I picked it up. The bandit did. Give it! Looks like a note on how to teach a certain technique to a monster. Not that a dumb monster could ever learn to use a technique like this. Oof, oof, oof! What? Is this what you want? Woof. There's nothing Repeat can't use. Oh, well, alright. I'll read it to you. Woof! I can't believe I'm making the Repeat bark sounds now. That's all there is to it. You think you got all that? Woof woof! Special skill. The doggy got stronger again. Woof! I earned a nanny title? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Woof! Too much woofing. Woof woof woof! <laughs> you mustn't vacillate about your life? Vacillate? All the thinking in the world won't ever answer the question, what is the meaning of life? Huh. Woof woof! Oh my gosh, my neighbor's dogs are now barking. <laughs> One must never turn back simply because the mountain is tall. 
As long as you keep putting one foot in front of the other, any mountain can eventually be crossed. Speak English, Vesperia! English, Mother Eva, do you speak it? <laughs> I'm not going to become a noble. What's the point? I'm just going to do what I want. Yep, live life happy. Weakness is something only the common man is permitted. Strength above all is respect- Oh, I- How come none of your dialogue gets updated? You boring man. <clears throat> um, anything new? Anything new? Limbergrade is gate. I would love to be a knight. It would be so fulfilling to live such a righteous life. I'm right here! Um... Anything up here? Any people? No people. Let's just check the room. Mm, nothing. Okay, I'm just gonna go. I guess the only thing to do in this town was a repeats thing. Yeah, I'm gonna have to finish the warehouse off camera. So screw that noise. Old man! Torum Harbor is east from the exit on the other side. Right now, the fortunes market is re reigning supreme. Supreme crunch wrap. From Taco Bell. Did you say no people? <laughs> no people. But yeah, sometimes I say it like people. Give me all the peoples. To all the ladies. <laughs> then the guilds, Dongrest. But I did everything in Dongrest. No wait, I had to go back to Dongrest for something. Let's just go to Dongrest. Again. This time I'll land on a side that has a bridge. Let's go! <clears throat> because I had to talk to the Union for something. Right? It's hey, you. It sounds like things could get ugly over in the Empire, doesn't it? Oh wait, I thought you were like another fortune teller lady. I was wrong. Okay, okay. Union, union. Oh wait, let me talk to um Heidel Man. My teenage dream was to become invisible. <laughs> Being invisible would be cool, but the power I want the most is um teleportation. That way I don't have to drive anywhere anymore. You Hey, it's you again. Go out and let the- What? What do I have to do for Bunny Guild again? I know the lady at the pub was the upgraded accessories and costume stuff, but what was- What was Bunny Guild? I have to complete side quests or something? Wait, who would I have to talk to in Union for- For something? There was a whole cutscene about it before. Private rooms of the Union officials. Things are a little shaky because of the difficulty in choosing a new Dawn. I want the power of an anime protagonist. Ugh. Oh, if only. You just keep getting stronger and stronger. You get the girl. That would be nice. Especially if you're like, protagonist of Sword Art Online and every single girl just latches themselves onto you. Ugh. I can't do sword art. The shield hero one seems interesting, though. Avern, Sagittarius. Mm-hmm. Lady, do I get any more upgrades? I got more titles. Blah 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 blah. You haven't a single thing I could boost. Damn it. Okay. I don't remember what who I have to talk to in Union. I still like SAO. I mean, there's a lot of people I know who still enjoy it, so I'm like, yeah, go for it, but it just did not click with me. I could not stand the main character dude. Actually, main character dude wasn't too bad, it's just that the girls like flock over him for no reason, it seems like. It's not like he's super strong. Or super smart, or super talented, but show sword art online. It's just I, 
It just seems so bland. I I couldn't do it. You're the Palka. I'm down. I hate harem enemies. Yeah. I remember like they were they weren't super fun, but I was able to tolerate them more in high school. So I watched like Love Hina, Tenchi, um what other harem enemies were there? There was Reverse Harem or Ron Ho High School Host Club, and I love that one. Uh, the Empire couldn't destroy this town even if they wanted to. Why not? It's simple. The Bing names from the Empire come here to have fun like everyone else. Tweet tweet! Tweet tweet! You're crazy. After the previous riots, we assumed the duty of maintaining security in this town. And we will continue to keep a watch over this town until our orders are receded, no matter how the people of this town may feel. <laughs> the knights are so stern and gloomy. They do well to take a load off and watch some fights, you know. Ooh, I just had a great idea. Why not pit knights against the guildsmen in the Coliseum? Now, wouldn't that be exciting? Uh, the garbage we used to watch as teenagers. For real, like, I tried rewatching some series that I watched when I was younger, and now I'm just like, this is terrible. Like, Trigun? I loved it as a kid. Tried watching it as an adult, I'm just like, bash? is super creepy and I cannot handle him. Oh yeah, Ranma one and a half. I remember watching oh man, and Inuyasha. Ugh. Yeah, I just don't watch those types of anime. But yeah, like the older I get, I like more serious anime and um I like slice of life. Did you ever see Outlaw Star? Okay, I still love Outlaw Star. That show is amazing and creepy. Like I love I Old anime I still love is like Outlaw Star, Cowboy Bebop, Sailor Moon, Gundam Wing. JK, I watch High School of the Dead every day. <laughs> I can't, man. Car uh... Captor. Oh, yeah. Car Captor was super cute. Oh, every year. <laughs> hey, oh, man. Not the new one though. Yeah, the clear card arc seems really weird and I'm like, why are you doing this? The only reason why I sort of glance through the manga is to see scenes of um, Sakura and Shodan together. Because I'm like, oh, you guys grew up and you're still in love and you're still so shy around each other. But uh, it's so weird. They threw rocks at us. They told us to arrest them. If we do, they'll just hate us even more. I was just another immigrant when I first moved here, but now I've really gotten used to the place and made a lot of friends. Just a little joke. No, all I care about are the matches in the Coliseum. She's the one who was mean to Patty. Screw you, lady. Is there anyone down here? Nope. This foolish noblewoman's gone and put her entire fortune on one of Itoken's tips. Not that anyone is in as much debt as I am, is really in any position to talk. Poor Bellius has died. This is no time to be gambling. But it can't stop. It's an addiction. That's not good, dude. Are you watching Rise of the Shield Hero? I actually um, watched a couple episodes, and it's interesting because they do a different take on the, um, hey, I got sucked into a video game world thing. So I like so far it's interesting, but who knows as it goes um further on if it'll stay as interesting or good. Uh I should finish my smoothie, sorry, hold up. We say it was the guardian deity that killed Duce Bellius. I suppose it wasn't our guardian at all, just a common monster. Whoa, lady. That's harsh. Uh, we're under orders from Lieutenant LeBlanc to support the Fling Brigade. Support me! It starts off strong, but it gets stale after a certain arc. Ooh, that's sad. You idiot, you've got no idea what the hell you're talking about. What did you just say, you pea brain peon? Damn it, you better watch your mouth. The city hasn't changed a bit. That's quite enough. You two will stop fighting right now. Who the hell are you? 
I'm Nats of Palestral. I'm the provisional douche. UJ. This season should be good, but if it gets a season, second season, I recommend skipping it. Okay. We'll definitely do that. I do not know the cause of your argument, but I shall help you resolve it. Resolve it? What's the point of crossing swords out in public like this? If you have a problem, you should settle it like men, in the Colosseum. If you beat him in battle, not only will you resolve your dispute, but your reputation will grow as well. What do you say? Son of a... I don't have time for something like that. No? Then I'll use my guild authority to have you locked up for disturbance of the peace. How does that sound? Damn it. This isn't worth the trouble. <laughs> Wuss! Thank you very much, Nuts. I don't know what happened here, but if you fought, you would have been given the same punishment. Please, be more careful in the future. Yes, I'm sorry. Good luck with your business. No, oh, it's you. Hello. I'm still indebted to you for everything you've done. It looks like things have gotten tough in town since Bellius passed away. What happened with the Duce was... The Deuce? I don't know. Was unfortunate, but nonetheless. Reincarnated as a slime is a way better way. I still have to start watching that. Ah! We couldn't go on forever depending on her to solve our problems. This is a town of humans. It's up to us to come together and figure out how to live together in peace. So you've been going around as the Duce's temporary replacement? Indeed. There will be a vote soon to determine who will officially end up taking her responsibilities. Who knows how that will turn out. I feel like Nordopolica's people have already chosen you to lead them. That's how it seems to me, at least. Ah, get out of the way! Move, move, move! It never ends. Oh boy, I don't think Jelly will like slime. Main character? OP main character? Ooh. We shall see. I mean, I'm not against giving anything a shot, but if it doesn't click with me, I'll just have to stop it. Unless it's a short series. If it's like a mini-series, like 12 episodes, 24 episodes, I'll watch it. But if it goes long, like 50, I, I probably won't finish it. Stop by again sometime if you'd like. Maybe we could sit down over some tea and share stories. Definitely. Wow, he's got it tough. Yeah, it can't be d easy dealing with all these crazies day in and day out. I hope he hangs in there. Oh, what? Estelle didn't want to talk to him after killing Bellius? <laughs> How boring. The knights are actually pretty well behaved. You might even say it's thanks to them things have quieted down around here. I've had Lord Knotts arrange for me to work at the Colosseum's library. It's quite befitting a city of such history. There are enough books there to satisfy any Critias thirst for knowledge. Is anyone a side quest person? They say the person who actually... Who was actually in charge of managing ah managing Palestral was the interim douche nuts. Belis's death doesn't seem to have been attributed to any failing of his management either. Dawn, Dawn, Dawn! Ah, the Dawn! How could the Dawn have died? This shock! How am I supposed to express it? I don't know, dude. The grown-ups say Bellius died, but I don't really understand. I never even saw her. Now that knights are here, and it's peaceful, right? What the fuck can do? I keep picking at the skin of my lips, and it's hurting, but I can't stop. Ow! Duce Bellius has passed away. I must offer my heartfelt condolences. Death means a great loss, but at the same time, a rite of passage for those who still live. Weird. Bellius died here, and the Dawn died in Dongrest. Who's next? The captain in Zephyrus? Hmm. The knights, those sneaky bastards. They think they could take over this town by smartly pretending to defend it? If only due to Bellius were still alive, she would never have permitted such tyranny. Knights aren't doing anything. All I know is she's small, blonde, braids her hair, and wears a black hat. It's hopeless. Hmm? I bite my nails and I can't stop. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> my lips have been so dry, because it's so dry and hot up here. 
and I put um, lip gloss on today to keep them wet, but like the thing about lip gloss is after a while, like all the skin on my lips gets super flaky and I'm just like, ah, peel them off. But now I'm peeling off too much. The town's pretty much back to normal thanks to the knights. Ooh, they're so grand. Whoops, better not say that too loud. My mom will give me a licking if she hears. The interim do just a pretty good job of keeping Palestra all together. Our only problem now is the knights making such a nuisance of themselves in town. Does anybody want to give me a side quest? What the hell is this lady doing? I swear I saw a giant bug striding atop the ocean, just as casual as could be. I guess it must have been a dream, but it seems so realistic. <laughs> oh, she's drunk. I don't want to do Coliseum, I just want to see if anyone wants to talk to me. I'm el hombre más fuerte del mundo! You're all nothing but swine! All the judgmental who shoot a little higher don't overestimate their ability. Rather, we do the best with what we have, simultaneously strive to outdo ourselves, and never fail to conquer our heroes. Lord Nats is using these chambers in his capacity as interim douche. The business you may enter. Did you take a minute? Oh shoot, is that time already? Oh my gosh. I did not. Thanks for reminding me, Master. Hey, it looks like things have calmed down a bit for Palestrel. Whenever I see your faces, I can't help but remember Bellius. Yeah, I still feel bad about that. I, too, bear some of the responsibility for Bellius' death. I'm sorry. No, it was rotten timing. Pain and simple. Pain and simple? For real? Besides, I have so many good memories of her. <laughs> I've been traveling on a solo journey around the world. The night that I first saw her, a full moon hung in the sky. I shivered with anticipation. It was a monster I've never seen before. If I beat it, I'd be famous. So you challenged her, Elias? Well, I was pretty foolhardy back then. And much to my surprise, I got my butt handed to me. When I came to, I was in the Colosseum, lying on a bed. You fought Bellius and lived. That's pretty impressive in and of itself. No, I wasn't even in the same league as Bellius. Ah, so she let you live. When I asked her why she spared my life, she told me this. There's nothing to be gained by making a short life even shorter. Oh, that's harsh. That sounds like something only an age-old Entelikea could say. So she's seen thousands of humans come and go in her lifetime. Even if they became her friends, or her subordinates, she'd eventually outlive all of them. I can't even imagine how lonely that must be. When she passed away, she was finally freed from that terrible loneliness. That's why I think that what happened wasn't such a bad thing at all. Hmm, maybe you're right. Oops, sorry if I got off on a tangent there. I never know when to stop talking. Not at all. Thank you for sharing something so precious. Yeah, I feel like I understand Bellius a little better now. Okay, but that was nothing. Here's a conspiracy for you. What if I only come to your street to remind you to take your medicine? But you're still being helpful and talking and doing stuff, so thank you. Oh, Nordopolica Warehouse. Oh, that seems like a big kettle of fish. Cholesterol will get you first. <laughs> yeah, work off your fat cholesterol. The door is locked. Not fat cholesterol, bad cholesterol. Whoops. Okay, well, I guess there's nothing in Nordopolica, and I don't really fight, feel like fighting in the Coliseum, so I shall be on my way. Oh man, but I really want to finish that Torum warehouse, but I really can't understand this map. It's just so weird. There's nothing here, the... The worried guy, warehouse, and tournament. Okay. Yeah, like, he's talking about Patty, but... I talked with him and nothing happens. Is that supposed to happen? And warehouse, I probably can't do it until I finish, um, Torum's warehouse, huh? Why is the statue headless? 
Rory gotta give Patty quest, but Patty needs to do a lot of cooking. This four of five of nine, nice! Congrats! Wow, you got through. You're blasting through nine. You're almost at the end. Ah! I freaking love the ending cutscene of um of Final Fantasy Nine. Bring my dagger back to me. Ah, so good. Patty, do a lot of cooking, you say? Well, I'm gonna start doing some cooking, even though we don't really need anything. Um, cook. Just cook it! Yay, successfully cooked. Patty is master chief. Come to me! My dagger! I love 9, it's so good. I love all the older Final Fantasy, so good. Mantaic! Oh, while I'm in Mantaic, I could go to the desert and I could get a flame stone and then I can do things. What was I supposed to do with them? Flame, flame stone, and oh, the juice guy, and then oh, that's what I was supposed to do at Union. Make a sword. Hey, Carol. What's up, Yuri? We finished the cell's request. Shouldn't Brave Asperia start looking for other jobs? Yeah, you're right. Hmm, I wonder what we should do. We could get a job in Dongrest if we were members of the Union. Hey, kid, didn't you know? The Union will throw you work even if you don't join them. They take a cut, but... Really? Really? <laughs> but it'll take us some time to return to Dongrest from here. If we can't find the Union's outpost staff around, we might be able to get a job. Then why not look for them? Judith, you coming? Woof. Okay, let's go. Hmm... I've never played a Final Fantasy except for 10, but I never finished 10. I finished 10 like four or five times. I loved it. <laughs> I see. So the chief and the others left the town this morning. I'm not sure if they left the town, but they did spend the night here last night. And I'm fairly sure that their leader was your chief. I see. Mister, who was that man just now? Oh, he said something about being a member of a guild called the Hunting Blades, I believe. It seems he got separated from the rest of his guild, though. Did Nan stay here last night? Nan? Chill out, Carol. You can't expect him to know that. Sir, members of that guild were staying at this inn, correct? Yeah, they were here until early this morning. Was there a girl with brown hair traveling with them? Actually, I seem to remember someone like that. Yes. She looked like she'd been injured somehow. That must be her wounds from fighting with us. Oh no. You don't know that for sure. Those guys get into fights all the time. Hey, Yuri, you think we might be able- We might be here for the night? Looks like the kid's a mess. Some relaxation would be good some for his nerves. I'm starting to not be able to talk. Blah, 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 blah. Save and eight. Yeah, I beat- I beat ten like four or five times. 8 I beat 3 times, 9 I beat twice, 7 I beat twice, 6 I beat once because it was so hard, 5 I didn't beat at all because my game just stopped working, 4 I beat 3 times, 3, 2, 1 I beat once. I remember playing time when I was 7 or 8 years old! <gasps> I forget how young you are! Dang, I was in high school! <laughs> this is the worst side quest, guild quest. There's seven parts to it and it's long and highly missable. Oh, dang. Maybe I should do it in this playthrough so that I don't worry about it next time. Well, there's that too. Hmm. At the end? Yeah, sure. Good idea. Let's get some rest. Well, you said it. Nan. Can't sleep, huh? Judith, why are you up? It's so late. I was just watching the moon. The moon? You're worried for that girl? Yeah. You're a nice kid, Carol. I've been in so many different guilds. 
But I ended up doing such a cruddy job in all of them and quitting. So all the guilds just gave up on me. But then, then... She invited you into her guild? Uh, yeah. But we still haven't made up since we got in that fight. Sorry, I'm a member- I'm a member of Brave Vesperia now. I shouldn't be thinking about all this. I don't blame me for it. She's important to you, right? Uh, how did you... You wouldn't carry around a picture of her if she wasn't important. You... you knew? I've seen you looking at her picture with that silly look on your face several times now. Oh, I got a friend of mine from the photography guild I used to belong to take that picture for me. A little photography on the sly? No, I mean, he just happened to take it as she was passing by. I mean, I guess it works out to the same thing. What a naughty boy. But I don't really think it's all that bad, really. Really? I wonder... You think we'll run into her again? Not sure. No, I know we will. I still have to make up with her. <laughs> Good luck with that. Well, I'm going to bed. Good night. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Judith. I'm not that young. I'm big boy! I can feed myself and use the bathroom by myself. <laughs> Mommy, wow! Boop, 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 boop. I'm a big kid now. Boop, boop. Wow, that's an old commercial. A whole bunch of knights showed up again a while ago. I was so worried they were here to take over the town again. Okay, so I started that quest here. I'm an adult, damn it! <laughs> Treat me with respect! Hello, cow kid. I don't want to fall into the hole. Who are you? Ding dong, I'm Carol's. You can call me KZ for short. Nice to meet ya. KZ, don't you think Carol's is plenty short enough? No need to be so sassy, Flatty McChesterson. Oh, snap burn! Flatty McChesterson! <laughs> I feel like the- I like the cut of your gym, KZ. I'm surrounded by idiots. What's the point of having big boobs anyway? They just get in the way! I guess? So, what are you doing in a place like this anyway? Good question! I guess you could say I'm helping out with some chores. Oh, that's so nice of you to help your mother with the chores. My mother? You crazy? Who said anything about that? I'm helping out the Antlion Man. Is Antlion Man the name of a friend of yours or something? Ipperoo! Something like that, Miss Bouncy Bouncy. Excuse you, that's sexual harassment against you. Stop it. <laughs> bouncy Bouncy. Ooh, Carol, what are you thinking? Anyway, could you let me borrow an apple gel? If you do, I'll show you what I mean. Yeah, sure, why not? Apple gels are easy to get. Okay, thanks! Round and round we go. Where we stop, only I know. Catch! Woohoo! Thank you, thank you! The hell was that? What the heck was that? That is my friend, the Antlion Man. You could call him A to the L for short. I'm at a loss. So, he took that apple gel, huh? I think so. I was too flabbergasted by all this weirdness to really notice. Yo, give that apple gel back, you... Give it back? Don't be so heartless, Flatty. You'll just have to take this instead. Here. I got a milk. Fresh squeeze from the udders of yours, true though. <laughs> Oh, I don't want to drink that milk. Oh. Oh. Big milkies are nice, but flat is just... <laughs> don't worry, Rita, I still like you. What's that nice noise? It's crap, it's FBI Sama. <laughs> They're always watching you. Moo -hoo -hoo. This kid creeps me out. What the freak is this cow's kid? Yuri, throw the bottle of milk away. Can I talk to you again? 
I'm gonna kill you dead, baby. Yeah, so dead. Oh, you're a weird and scary child. Woo. Who do I talk to? Who do I talk to? Say, do you know about the hole that's back behind the inn? There's something strange in it. What could it be? It's kind of scary. I'm too afraid to jump into the hole to find out, so you can find out for yourself, lady. Ow, my old lady really wants to work on me again. All I did was stay out till dawn three days in a row. That's so bad. Yes, it is. You jerk. Hey, kid, how's it going? Oh, it's you. Yay. Thank you for saving our mommy and daddy. Ah, shucks, kids. Twerk nothing. What are you getting all bashful for, old man? After all, we even got a reward for helping them. Oh, what's the matter? Hey, it's you! Thank you so much for your help back there. Thanks to you, our children have someone to take care of them again. No, really, we hardly did anything. No, no, it's thanks to all of the precious water you shared with us that we're here today. I doubt this really... This is really enough to thank you for all you've done, but... Hourglass! Woo! Thank you! It's the least we could do. Thank you! Here you go. Huh? This is important to you, right? You can have it back. But... Don't worry, your mom and dad already gave us something to thank us for helping them. We couldn't take your reward, too. That would be greedy. Okay. See you later, okay? Hand it over glass marble. Oh, we still had that. Oh, we forgot about it. A cow child who follows an ant man and also produces milk. There's a lot to process. Yeah, everything is just weird and gross. Is there a hidden item? No, there was not. Makes me wonder if breast milk tastes like regular milk. Braid, why are you so weird? I, I don't think it does. But I don't want to think about it. <laughs> hey. Hey there, Raven. Your friend there, that's uh, that's the little guild hopper, right? The name's Carol. I'm a member of a guild called Brave Vesperia now. Oh, Brave Vesperia, huh? So what business does your guild have with us? Is this the Union Outpost? Yeah, looking for a job? Well, let's see. This is about all I've got at the moment. I request transportation for my goods. You, Saren. What's this supposed to mean? There's no detailed information here. Well, it is the Union. They're probably all going to be pretty standard jobs. Should be just about right for one of your first jobs. It pays 4200 gold. Hold on a sec. Brave Asperia isn't a member of the Union, you know. Huh? You're unaffiliated. Okay, so with the 30% finder's fee, that brings your take down to 3,000 gold. What do you think? You want it? Yeah, maybe just do it. Man, 30%. Could have just kept quiet, Raven. That's just the way it works. It'd be worse if they found out later. It's fine. I mean, we're already here, right? Let's do it, Carol. Alright. Now go talk to the client. They'll fill you in on all the details of the job. Use a guy who usually hangs out around the bridge near the entrance of town. Alright, let's go and talk to him. There's a mini game in Judy hometown. By talking to a kid, finish them all and you get one of Judy's best looking in-game costume titles! <gasps> ah! The knights are gonna protect this town, we're gonna be safe! Maybe I should join the knights too. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Well, I was gonna... <sighs> Wait, Judy... Judith Town. Jormgen... Yorzo... Her hometown... was... Temza. So, if I go to Temza, I'll get the side quest? I wasn't even thinking about visiting dungeons, but... Oh no, maybe I should visit dungeons so I could get, um... materials. And whatnot, and I gotta get Patty to cook more. Apparently, breast milk is slightly sweet, like cantaloupes or melons. Ooh, that, oh, I don't want to think about that. And it's much better than warehouse. <laughs> mm. Let's see. Okay, so I'll have to make sure after 
doing everything here, I go to uh, Mount Temza. Okay. Um, let's talk with the dude. The flying jelly thingy around the world map. Oh, it's that one. Oh, okay, I thought you meant uh, Mount Temza. Okay. Sorry, it's creepy. But so is being pregnant. Yeah, that is creepy. Bridge around the end of town. You? Are you Mr. Saren? Yes, I'm you, Saren. Are you from the Union? Yeah, we're a guild, Brave Asperia. Brave As... I haven't heard of you. Don't worry, we can handle it. You need people to deliver some stuff, right? Yes, I'd like someone to take a book to an old friend of mine. A book? Yes, quite an important one. It's a book that holds memory memories for us. We'll make sure to take good care of it. Please don't lose it. If that should happen, I'll have to pay. I'll have you pay compensation for the lost item to the Union. Harold said, "Don't worry, right? So don't worry." And who might this friend of yours be? His name is Nobis Celestial. He's currently traveling, so I don't exactly know where he is. I think he's probably in one of the cities on Tolbikia or Desir. Please take this crest. If you carry this with you, he should recognize it and call out to you himself. A fiery soul into the sea of flames. You'll know it's Nobis if he says this to you. Okay, got it. We accept this task in the name of the brightest star in the night sky, Brave Vesperia. Thank you for your help. So I have to go... Oh man, I have to go town hopping for this dude now. What was that thing you said at the end there that sounded like a magic spell? It's a note for taking a new job. It's proof that you accept the client's request. Interesting. Alright, let's go look for Nobis. Aggressive bark! <laughs> book of friendship, common requests. A book filled with complicated formulas, theories, and everything about male bonding. Male bonding. Okay! I mean, I'm not surprised this babies only really like sweet things. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, Jelly, you get endgame tickets? I did get endgame tickets, but I got it for Saturday in the afternoon at 3. So... Because we wanted to go earlier than, um, than nighttime because tickets are cheaper. <laughs> woof woof! That's a choice. The bro code. <laughs> Male bonding, you say? No, oh, I'm sorry, you can't make it. I'm so sorry, I wish I could. But we should hang out some other time. And do some Pokemon trading. I just... What's happening now? Wait! Thief! Whoa! Prepare to die. <laughs> Give back what you stole! <gasps> no! Uh, please, no! I'm sorry! Are you okay? Yes, thank you so much! Uh, I can't believe a knight saved me! I'm so happy! Jeez, are all the kids in this town as reckless as you? I hope not. It would not have turned out well for you if we hadn't been passing by. I know, but I just couldn't let that thief get away. A lot of justice, I see. I'm going to be a knight when I grow up, so I can't just ignore bad guys. Becoming a knight is easier said than done. What do you mean? You tried to take on two adults totally unarmed. If we hadn't helped, you know what would have happened? Come on, Flynn. You need to know your own strength, and if it isn't enough, you'll have to rely on others to help you. It'd be impossible to beat a pair of knights watching each other's backs, right? But... Needing other people's help is uncool. No, it's not! Right. But dying doesn't get you anywhere. Worrying about whether you look cool or not is idiotic. If that's the only reason you want to be a knight, you'll never make it in a million years. Still, not many adults have a fraction of your courage. You'll become a great knight, so long as you remember to work hard and don't get cocky. You think so? I do. I will work hard, and I will become a knight. Thank you, sir.
Okay. That gave me chills. It's like, like I just saw myself. Yeah, you were kind of like that when you first set out on this journey with us. I really thought you were just going to smash that child's dream to smithereens. You really didn't pull any punches. I was only trying to impart some realistic advice. I think your nightly advice was exactly what that child needed to hear, Flynn. And it's not like he said anything that isn't true. All's well that ends well, right? Mark of Knighthood title. Betrayed. This kid wants to die. Says Angel Wings. Flynn and his goody goody yaw. Be like Yuri, damn it. If only there was a mesh between Yuri and Flynn. That'd be perfect! I saw it! I saw it! I saw it! There was a huge bird flying in the sky. But that's only half of it. There was a dragon, too. Even bigger than the bird. Do you think our barrier will be enough to keep him out? Hells no, your barrier weak. Alright, I am going to end this stream here. I'm getting super sleepy. But I need to remember... Let me try cooking with Patty again. Cook! Yes! I guess I just gotta keep cooking with Patty to get her to be a better cook. But I'll serve this here. Whoa, I lost so much money. Oh, because I synthesized a lot. Okay. Well, that's it for me. Maybe I think throughout the week I'll just do the warehouse myself. And I gotta go fighting in the desert for some flamestones. But Next week, I think I'm going to be streaming earlier than my normal time, only because I'm dog-sitting a puppy and so I can't get back too late. So yeah, next week I'll try streaming like an hour earlier. To yeah, that should be fine. So more tales next week. Remember to watch in Reincarnated as a Slime. I shall remember. Puppy stream? I would, but it's not my puppy, so I don't want to show puppy online sorry if i ever got a puppy myself i would totally do puppy streams but yeah anyways i'm exhausted i need to go pass out good night everybody thanks for watching i'll see you next time stay toasty bye bye good night <laughs>